let's make a little fire. I've got a replaceable bit honeysuckle hand drill spindle and I've got my uh, fat wood thumb sling thunderhead that I made at Boy Scout summer camp this year. Let's give it a go. My fireboard is white pine and my hand drill bit is a golden rock. It's just that easy, folks. My, uh, Bird's nest is fuzzed up jute twine and some cedar shavings and some uh, cottonwood down from this past summer. go just that easy I'll put a link to the video where I uh, sort of showcased my miniature handmade fatwood thumb sling thunderhead I'll put that link to that video down in the description for you to take a look at this is what I really wanted to show you this is a piece of honeysuckle it's about 15 inches long from bottom to top I cut it green and let it dry in my basement for a couple weeks before I started working on it it's just about pin straight and I'd say it's about a half inch in diameter one of the interesting things about honeysuckle is that it's got a hollow core. And on the top, what I did was I took a twig and tapped it into the top to sort of reinforce it. And then I whittled it to a, a light taper so that it fits into my thumb sling thunderhead nicely. And on the bottom, on the bottom what I did was I took the uh, awl bit of my uh, Swiss Army knife and I opened up the hole and I worked it and worked it and worked it and worked it. It took a while and I worked the hole about three quarters of an inch up into the honeysuckle and I think I measured it. It was close to five sixteenths of an inch in diameter when I was all done with it. And then what I did was I took some artificial sinew and I whipped it onto the bottom to reinforce it. I think I put three layers of artificial sinew, wrapped it back and forth, got it as tight as I could. What I didn't want to happen was when I jammed my 
goldenrod spin or bit into the spindle. I didn't want it to break apart. Uh, this bit is jammed in there pretty tight right now, so I'm not going to try to pull it out. I'll pull it out a little bit later and take a picture of it and put it at the end of the video so you can see. But when I jammed it in there, I did hear it start to crack just a little bit. So I was thankful that I put this whipping on. With the whipping on, I'm sure that this thing will last for a long, 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 long time. Anyway, replaceable bit, honeysuckle, hand drill spindle. Works great. Maybe you'll give yourself a try. That's all for now. See you again soon.